good morning to our lecturer. Today we gonna present about our business model canvas. We are from SAP Group T12. First, let me introduce you to our group members. First, we have Liana Christina, Mimi Nornajwa, Mila Wati, Mohammad Aishi Bazri, Lastly, is me, Lau Pechi. Now, we start with our business model canvas that have nine components, which is value position, customer statement, channel, customer relationship, revenue stream, key partners, key activities, key resources, lastly, cost structure. Enjoy the video's presentation. Hey everyone, my name is Milawati Tahasan and my metric number is H19A0210. I will present about business model canvas which is value profession. In value profession, there are three elements which is which of our customer problem are we helping to solve. Then, which of customer need are we satisfying and the last one is what are the key feature of our product that match a customer problem and need? First, we talk about which of customer problem are we helping to solve. There are one of customer problem that we helping to solve, which is uh, to be to be one of the selected product of our customer. Uh, meaning to say. We try to make our product can be easy to buy for our customer. Then, from this, our customer can can buy our product with the cheapest and better price. Next, which of which of our customer need are we satisfying? They are two. They are two of customer need that we are satisfying which is uh, functionality and price first functionality this is because our customer need our product to function the way they need in order to fulfill their dream their problem and desire the last one is price our customer have a unique budget with which they can purchase our product with the cheapest price. The last one is what are the key features of our product that makes a customer problem on it? There are, there are two key features that match our product which is uh, what to buying and fulfill the need of the customer. Thank you, Mila. Hello, Rachel and all my friends. My name is La Pechi. My metric number H1980187. I will present about the customer statement. For the target group in our company, there are no age limit. The target group can be teenage student, young people, families, children, adult, and tourists. In short, the average age for the teen is 12 years old to 22 years old, while for the adult is 25 years old to 35 years old. Next, for the channel, we use social media for our promotion such as Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and WhatsApp. In the social media, we post the information about our company, for example, the menu with the price, the location about our store, promotion product, feedback from the customer, and others. The customer can refer to the social media for the reference. Besides, we choose this channel because it is easy, convenient, and cheap. Thus, we doesn't need more budget for the promotion. Thank you. That's all from me. I will pass to another presenter. Thank you, T. Next, I will present about customer relationship and revenue stream. Customer relationship describes the type of relationship a company establishes with its specific customer segments. 
Mama Juicy maintains its relationship with the customer through personal assistant, where the order taker communicates with the customer during the purchase and helps the customer place the order. The order taker will also answer various questions from customer about the type of fruit juice sold in the store and the nutritional value of the fruits. For customers who buy for the first time at Mama Juicy, they do not know which juice to buy. Therefore, the order taker will help the customer to choose the juice that suits their taste and can also recommend the best selling juice. In the aspect of improvement, we improve products based on feedback from customers. Customer says that the juice has no sweet taste. As a result of this feedback, we provide self-service for customer by placing sugar syrup at the pickup counter for customer who love sweets to pop up the level of sweetness they want. Mama Juicy also has social media accounts like Instagram, Twitter and Facebook to communicate with the customers better. Mama Juicy will introduce new menus, discounts and share the benefits of fruits on social media. Not only that, customers can also share photos and buying experience to Mama Juicy and other customers by putting the hashtag Mama Juicy. Next, I will present about revenue stream. Revenue streams are the various sources from which a business earns money from the sales of goods or the provision of services. Revenue stream represent the cash a company generates from each customer segment. The revenue streams of Mama Juicy come from asset sales, which is transaction generated by the customer when purchasing the drinks at the counter, which are strawberry juice, passion fruit juice, and orange juice. The price for the three juices is the same as eight ringgit with the regular size. The best-selling product of Mama Juicy is passion fruit juice. In this case, we will over-purchase stock for passion fruit products to avoid material insufficiency. That's all for me, and next, I will pass to the next presenter. Thank you. Thank you, Kina. Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Aishi Bazli bin Abu Bakar. My metric number is H1980213. So, I will continue to explain about the key partners and key activities. Firstly, the key partners, our company, Mama Juicy Partners, based on the supplier. Our suppliers come from the Cameron Highland Pahang. We get the fresh fruits such as orange, strawberry and marquisa fruits and raw materials. At there, with the cheapest price, high quality and delicious flavors from the suppliers. In addition, we also can manage our time, manpower and reduce costs to save company money. Besides, our key partners also based on the five members involved which are me, Chi, Lina, Milan, Mimi that operate the Mama Juicy business at Pahang. The reason why our company based on partnership business is because we had good teamwork, hard working and they had the same vision and mission to success as entrepreneurs. Next, I will continue with the key activities the first point is about the sales and marketing. Mama Juicy operates the business by selling the product at the store. It is a walking buying concept. So to grab the juice drink must come to our store. Next, the production process. Our production process to produce the Mama Juicy drinks will going through the machine at our store. It will be monitoring and checking the test to make sure we produce a high quality drinks. 
Therefore, we can improve what we lacking of. Lastly, about the supply chain management is can be seen through the direct channel when our company get the raw material and fresh fruits from the suppliers and then directly transfer to the store and we produce the and lastly we sell it to our customers that's all from me thank you hi i'm mimi noyajua binti mali and my matric number is h1 I'm Administration Manager at Mama Juicy and I will present about key resources and cost structure that conduct business activity at Mama Juicy. Key resources are the most important to uh, make business model work. It has four main categories which is physical, human resources, intellectual and financial. First category is physical. That have three main points, which is raw good, building, and machine. Raw good is ingredient to make our juice, for example, strawberry, orange, passion fruit, sugar, and other. Second is building. Mama Juicy have building at Camera Highland Pahan. It easy for our business conduct our main activity, which is selling beverage fresh juice. That a machine. That machine is to make sure it easy to process fruit. Second category is human resources, and it was staff. All staff play a role in operation this business, so that it can become a successful business. For example, making advertising, and so on. Third category are intellectual resources. Our brand have their own symbolic such as the tree fruit which is strawberry, orange and passion fruit were the main ingredient for our beverage juice. It also have our winning company, company Mama Juicy. Last category in key resources are financial resources. Our company made been loan to operate this business for the first time. But not only been loan, we also use our own equity for make sure our business can operate. Net a cost structure. This final step in the process is important. There are two main category of cost structure, which is fixed cost and variable cost. Fixed cost at Mama Juicy are rent for building, salary and insurance for all workers. And second are variable cost, which is advertising for our business, material to make our juice, and last is utilize. utilize. These two costs is important to make sure our business activity can operate as we want. That's all from us. Thank you.